This is the AL66 from Yunzi, and it's the best sounding keyboard that I've ever typed on. That was just a short teaser, and there's going to be a full typing test later on in the video, but you can just hear why I love this thing. As you can tell from the name, the AL66 is a 66 key wireless mechanical keyboard. You can find it for just $100 on Amazon. In the box, you get the keyboard, a dust cover, some nice extra keycaps, a keycap and switch puller, and a USB-C to USB-A cable. Regardless of the price, it's up there as one of the most premium keyboards I've ever used. If you get sold on this while watching this video, the Amazon link is down below. Now before I go through why I really love this thing, I'd appreciate it if you guys can subscribe to the channel, it's totally free and it really helps out a ton in running this channel. So why this keyboard feels so premium starts with the build quality. Including the knob in the corner here, this is an all aluminum CNC machine case with a gasket mount structure inside. The aluminum has a bit of texture to it and it's not overly smooth, which kind of reminds me of a MacBook Air but not as smooth. Smooth. Combined with these materials and the 5-fold filling inside, this keyboard is really dense, no room for flex here and pretty heavy at 1.1 kilograms, which is pretty ideal for your at-home office or gaming desk setup. The keycaps are standard cherry profile and underneath are the switches with pre-loop stabilizers. These are Yunzi's signature milk switches. Of course, all the keycaps and switches are hot swappable with support for any 3-pin or 5-pin switches, but I personally never want to swap these switches out. They feel and sound so, so good. There's just enough resistance here to make each press feel intentional, but easy to type on. These switches sound like raindrops or seashells or whatever this sounds like. To be fair, it's not super quiet, but the noise is soft and not clacky, so I don't think it'll make anyone angry next to you. Personally, it's the most satisfying sounding keyboard I've ever typed on. Yes, there are RGB lights under the keys and some on the sides. You can use a knob to change the RGB modes, which is cool. If you don't want that, you can also long press it to use a knob for volume control instead. Personally, I think having these RGB lights on kind of ruins the really sleek design here, so I mostly keep them off. So all these things make it very comfortable to type on at your desk and just all around a very premium experience. By the way, this is the silver version, but the AL66 is also available in black, pink, and blue, and they all look pretty awesome. My only personal gripe about the design here is a layout, which isn't really fair. I'm just a big fan of the 75% layout with all my F keys and a little more spacing, but I do see the benefit of this layout because it keeps things even more minimal on my desk. But yeah, Yunzi, if you make a AL75, please email me. In terms of other features and general experience, it's got the basics down. You can pair this keyboard to your device in three different ways, wired, Bluetooth 5.0 wireless, or 2.4G wireless using the little receiver at the top here. I personally use Bluetooth because of how convenient it is, and the latency for my kind of productivity is basically nothing. It's very responsive and very quick to wake up from sleep. With Bluetooth, you can connect up to three devices at the same time and quickly switch between them using the function and Q, W, E keys. Of course, it's compatible with anything, including Windows, Mac, Android, iPadOS, or anything else with Bluetooth, really. Then using the custom software, you can make your own RGB light effects in addition to the default ones and customize your macros and keybinds too. The downside is that this software is only on Windows right now, so I couldn't do any of these customizations on my current MacBook. Moving on to the battery, which has been pretty great. Inside the AL66 is a 4600 mAh battery. So far, I've only had to charge it once every three weeks or so. The LED on the bottom here shows you your connection and battery status. So whenever it goes red and I'm going out somewhere with my laptop, I just plug it into my MacBook charger and it's all ready for me by the time I get back. Super convenient and the battery life has been more than reliable. Okay, with all that out of the way, here is a full-on typing test with the AL66. Okay, so putting everything together, the Yunzi AL66 is a premium mechanical keyboard with a very thoughty, satisfying typing experience. At this price and the quality you're getting, I think this keyboard is a bargain and is a much better buy than keyboards that are 50% more or twice the price from much bigger brands. Like I said earlier, if you're interested, the Amazon link is down below. Now, if $100 is too much for you, I recommend at least looking into Yunzi's Milk Switches. These things are a game changer and might make your keyboard sound like this. All right, that's going to do it for this video. Let me know in the comments what your thoughts are about the AL66, and if you think this sounds as good as I think it does. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next video.